Hi, this is Stieg Plantel, demonstrating set-driven attributes for Slimer. The bones in place lead us right to the hand here, the left hand. This control curve that's going to drive and control and operate the left arm IK handle has these attributes on it. Going to grab, we have a thumb that's working nicely. That will be the focus of this demo to demonstrate a full fist functionality. There we go, the, the full animation pose from 0 to 10. Very easy for your animator. Let's go and delete this one and make a new one. Right here, we're going to add attribute, make it a con unique name, grab. We're using an integer data type, minimum of 0, maximum of 10, default of 10. 10 will be a full open hand, 0 will be closed grabbing pose. OK. OK is going to close the dialog box and add an attribute right there, grab. Click on it, middle mouse drag. Aww, nothing happens. Not yet. I'm going to keep that at 10 because there's a couple more things we need to build. Go to key underneath the hot box menu. Set driven key. Hover over set, release. Here we have the option to load as driver, this controller and the thumb joints one, two, and three. I'm going to do them all at one time. It's much more efficient. So I'm going to load those as the driven. I know that these are rotating on the X axes because that's the way they were oriented. Other videos about that should be on this channel. I'm just hitting F8 to get in and out of object and component mode. In component mode I've right clicked and chosen local rotation axes so that I can see those when I need them. Or need a reminder of which way things are oriented. On the Rotate X channel, we're going to hook that to the Grab attribute underneath the IK control handle and key it. When I go to the closed fist or grabbing hand pose, that's going to be at zero. Going back to all my joints here, I'm going to hit E, rotate them. They have some of them limits on them, some of them don't. Looks like I have to go and edit that. But basically, if you key that, you should have a very functional set driven key when you middle mouse drag in the viewport. One step more advanced, if you analyze the movement of your thumb joint, the base of your thumb, it swings down when you're grabbing. So we're going to include the Z channel here on just this joint. We're going to make that the driven. Rotate Z. We know that we're in the pose of 10, so we're just going to go and key that one right now. At grab zero, we have this joint swing down. Just swing down on the Z channel. You can see I'm going to do it more precisely by clicking on the channel and operating just that so it swings down. Maybe a little less and key that. 
So when we actuate this attribute, the finger is moving predictably for a grabbing set driven attribute. And there you go. That is the set driven attribute for our Slimer character creating a grab controller for the thumb.